Hey there everybody, what is going on? It's Josh Wright here, back again with another video on MLB The Show 24. We got some more Road to the Show coming your way with Joey Gibbs. And as you can see, we are in Atlanta for this one. Turning my, uh, kind of turning my fan off a little bit. I apologize, it, uh, it gets really hot in my room sometimes. Like, uh, so... That's why, uh, for those of you who keep commenting, oh, why does it sound like uh, there's an AC going on? Uh, that AC is my fan. It gets really hot in my room. I really apologize. Like, I swear my, my room is probably the hottest room in, in the house. So I apologize if that bothers you guys. Um, I'll turn it off for you guys. Anyway, enough with the fan. Let's get into the game. As you can see, we are in Atlanta for today's game. Playing the Braves, we are in September. I believe I have like five starts left of the regular season, and then we will be done uh, with the 2024 season. So I'll probably just might pre-record my, uh, my next five starts and then just upload them whenever. I uh, uploaded a video earlier today. I, I actually uploaded my uh, previous Joey Gibbs video today. That was a pre-recorded video. Um, my start against the Orioles. And then I am recording this video on a Monday. Uh, earlier today, I posted a video asking about angry, the angriest moments you guys have had being a sports fan you know what are some moments when you guys are watching your teams play when you're watching your teams play you know what are you know, you know we all have our favorite sports moments with our favorite teams you know favorite highlights favorite games but we also have games you know that make us you know uh as acuna hits a home run off of me start things off two nothing atlanta but, you know, we also have games that kind of make us, you know, pretty angry, you know, make us disappointed, upset, you know, frustrated. You know, we're probably breaking stuff, possibly throwing something at the TV or almost throwing something at the TV. Whether it's an umpire or a ref made a dumb call or, if, or you know, your coach made a dumb move or your player ended up missing, ended up failing on, on a... Uh, you know, big important, I don't really want to say failing, but, you know, they messed up on on a important, like on the last play of a game, probably like they struck out in a baseball game or they missed a game winning touchdown or they missed a, uh, missed the game winning point or something like that. I don't know. You know, what is your most, the angriest sports moment of your guys's career? And I, posted that video I uh, let everybody so that way people could comment and then we'll do a follow-up video to that and that video will probably be posted on Thursday Thursday um, August August uh, August 8th will be when that video comes out as I am giving up home runs left and right to Atlanta. Two run homer by Acuna and now a solo homer by, I think that's Ozzy Albies. Yes it is, 25 home runs for him on the year. So this is gonna be probably the worst start of Joe Gibbs' career. Giving up home runs uh, left and right. Here is Adam Duvall. Drop third strike, throw down to first is in time, and that is a big out number one. Well, well, then again, you know we're not, not every uh, not every team is going to be very, you know, easy to face. We're going to have some uh, tough opponents. The Braves, I mean, they have 96 wins for a reason. The Rockies are terrible, you know. At this point of the year, you know, we're we're. Obviously, we're not winning anything. We're in September. We have, I think, the third worst record in baseball. 54 and 86 is our record. And then the Braves, I think, are 96 and 45. So they are, like, 50 games better than us. So, 
Yeah. Rough uh, first two innings for Joey Gibbs here in Atlanta. As the score is now 3 nothing, Ing Braves on top. The Rockies do not score anything. So depending on how this video goes, or how this game goes, Joey Gibbs will probably be credited another loss. Which is something that we do not want to see. You know, you're going to have your good games on the mound, and you're going to have your bad games on the mound. There's a strike. Oh, that was up high, and the ump called it a strike. Oh, wow. That's going to miss two and two. So I, I think after this video, we will, uh, or after this game, we'll probably uh, go through the Rockies schedule for the rest of September. There goes one into right field. Catch is made, and that is out number one. So I'll bring in Orlando Arcia. Can't believe we're already in August of 2024. That is crazy. This year has gone by really fast. My eyes start school two weeks from today. That is, uh, that is crazy. Going for my uh, for my bachelor's degree, or not my bachelor's, my associate's degree. Sorry, bachelor's degree. That I think I'll need like two more years of school before I can get my bachelor's degree. But this year I'm going for my my associate's degree. Here's Acuna, this son of a you know what, ended up homering off of me. I thought you were hurt, buddy. I thought Acuna was hurt, but uh, I guess in this world. Uh, Injuries do not, um, you know, uh, concern him. Anyway, two outs. Here's the one, two. Got him. He can homer off me once. He's not going to homer off me twice. Here is Matt Olson. Here at the bottom of the fourth. The Rockies do score a run. Thank you, Rockies, for doing that. Um, that came on an RBI double by Jefferson Cuero, who's our our catcher, our lovely catcher behind the plate. Jefferson Cuero and I, we went to uh, a nice, uh, nice little restaurant in downtown Atlanta. We went to a little steakhouse because I guess that's what Atlanta is uh, famous for: is their steakhouses. I don't know. I couldn't tell you. I have a uh, I've been to Atlanta a couple times. I've been I've been through Atlanta a couple times in person, and um, I didn't really see any uh, any uh, steakhouses when I was there. Um, I did see, however, there was this uh, Italian restaurant. That was not too far from the hotel we were staying at, and that put and uh, it was really good. Like it had some really good like spaghetti. It had like Italian subs, you know, pasta, all different types of you know Italian food. So yeah, there there's some pretty uh, solid places to eat at it in Atlanta. Pretty solid restaurants. A lot of good areas in Atlanta. As Austin Riley grounds out to short for out number two. Here's Ozzy Albies. Here's the other guy that hit a home run off of me. They make it 3 nothing Atlanta. And now it's 3-1 to one Atlanta because uh, my catcher, he's uh, he wants to be uh, on my good side today. And he's going to, you know, do anything he can to try and help us win. All right, let's see. He wants a curveball. We'll give him a curveball. Oh my goodness, don't ever, ever throw it there again. You see, that's how, see kids, that's how home runs are hit. Mislocating my curveball and he absolutely just, he just froze on it. Froze on it like Carlos Beltran did in 
2006 against uh, Adam Wainwright and the Cardinals. The power of a curveball. All right, one, two count. There's a strikeout on a cutter. The Joey Gibbs settling down a little bit after the second inning. Here is Marcelo Zuna, 0 for 1. Filling in for Ronald Acuna while, uh, while in real life, while Acuna's hurt. Ozuna, he's been a pretty solid hitter for Atlanta this year. There's another strikeout for Joey Gibbs. Back to back, that's his ninth K of the day. You know, he may have given up a couple home runs, but after that, I think it's like, okay, I've settled in now. I'm ready to go. Let's do this. Let's dance. You know, let's boogie. Let's boogie. As, uh, the uh, adults say these days. Let's boogie. Alright, one ball, two strikes. Here's the pitch to Sean Murphy. A drop third strike. And hey, look at that. I struck out the side. Striking out the side. And we got a new boss, boss challenge. Uh-oh, Michael Harris. 0 for 2. Uh, Really wish the Rockies could score for me here. They, got, We got a few hits in this game, so that's good. The Braves committed a couple errors. Thought the Braves had the best infield in baseball. Who were their, what were their, uh, their errors from? Let's see real quick who their errors were from. Michael Harris and Marceau's... Oh, so it's not their infield, it's their outfield. Well, I thought the Braves had a good outfield, too. But, uh, I guess not. I guess not, buddy. I guess not. Nothing in two to Michael Harris. Oh, come on. That's a strike. Blue. What are you talking about? He went around. Ha ha. Gotta. Gotcha. 11 strikeouts now for Joey Gibbs. And now bring in Orlando Arcia. One for two. He has one of the three Atlanta hits in this game. He got the first hit of the game for the Braves and then scored on a home run by Ronald Acuna, who's up next. All right, so here comes Acuna. First pitch to him, ball one. Now we're starting to pitch good. One ball, two strikes. One ball, two strikes. To Mr. Ronald Acuna, former MVP. Can you check how many awards he has on here? Oh, I can. Um, just one, the 2023 MVP, 2018 Rookie of the Year, All-Star, all that stuff. That's cool. What's, what's even more cool is I struck you out twice. You might have homer off me, but I struck you up twice. Dakota Hudson, do your stuff. And Atlanta lost the game, uh, six to two. Well, or and Atlanta won the game six to two. I guess I should say. Well, you know, not the best start, but you know, we had twelve strikeouts. I mean, I'll take it. Twelve strikeouts through six innings. Hey, that's that's not bad. All right, we're going to take a look at the schedule real quick before we uh, sign off for the day. So as you can see, we got swept by Atlanta. Um, we also are we're also on a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven game losing streak. Yeah, we're bad. We'll be going to Milwaukee for a little bit. Then we're going to Detroit. Then we got three games at home against the Cubs. Three games against the Diamondbacks. Six games with the Dodgers and three games with the Cardinals. And then we will be ending the regular season. Then we'll go to the playoffs and all that fun jazz. So, and also, might as well just take a look at the standings real quick. Give you guys an idea of what's going on in the 
in the world of baseball and Joey Gibbs' perspective. So in the National League East, as you can see, we just played the Braves. They just swept us out of Atlanta. Uh, they are 97 and 45, first place. Um, second place, we have the Phillies, who are currently in first place right now, but they're uh, starting to cool off a little bit. I don't know what happened to them in Seattle. Luckily, they got the win, I think, uh, Sunday night. Uh, but they are now they're six games up on on Atlanta right now, in in real baseball. But as you can see, Braves are in first, Phillies are in second, and then the rest of the National League East is kind of a train wreck. The Nationals are in third, Marlins in fourth, and the Mets are in last. And now Central, it is the Cubs running away with the division, with the Cardinals 18 games out for first place. They are in second, while the Brewers are a game behind St. Louis. Are, uh, are in third, 70 and 70, right at the 500 mark. And then you have the Reds currently in fourth and the Pirates in last. So the National League West, yeah, the Dodgers are currently in first, a game and a half up on the Diamondbacks. So it'll be interesting to see uh, who wins who wins there between those two. Then you got the Padres, the Giants, and the Rockies, all in that order. As you can see, yeah, the Rockies are the worst team in the National League. American League, meanwhile, you have the Yankees r running away with the East, and then you have the Rays, Jays, O's, and Bo Sox, all in that order. AL Central, it is the Twins winning the Central right now, and then you have the Guardians, the Royals, Tigers, and White Sox, and the only difference is these White Sox are not on a 20-game losing streak, but uh, they're still pretty bad, kind of like the real White Sox. And then the American League West is the Astros, Followed by the Rangers, the Mariners, the Angels, and the Athletics. And uh, the White Sox are currently the worst team in baseball. And so, yeah, we're, at least we're 10 games better than the White Sox are. And so, ladies and gentlemen, that's probably going to do it for today's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Make sure to leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you're new here and if you enjoy the content. And, uh, yeah, that's all I got. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, take care.